What is going on boys and girls? It is Julian here back here with a brand new video and today we are rocking a video, a team around the guy that is on your screen right now and one of his teammates um, who we will add into the squad sh shortly. It is the inform Steve Mooney. I'm assuming it's not Mooney, it's that like Moonwe or Moonye, something like that. But I'm English, I'm gonna call him Mooney. This, this is what we're gonna call him. Obviously, Huddersfield are now in the Premier League, and he got this inform for absolutely tearing up Crystal Palace in a 3 0 win last weekend, which is just ridiculous, considering the fact it was their first game in the Premier League in like 40 years or something like that, and he absolutely smashed it out. We'll get into him in a bit, but we obviously want to build the squad around him first. Um, and I was proper um and iron about what, what formation to build this in, and to be honest, what video to do. Um, so, I did decide on a 4 3 one too. Obviously, did decide to honour him as the main focus player. And in goal, we do go for the inform um, Lopez, a bit of a, uh, a footballing legend, the Diego Lopez. Uh, he's got himself an inform card from months ago. 84 diving, 83 re reflexes, 87 handling, and 86 positioning. He's 6 foot 5 as well, so he should do a shift. He's, you know, a nice tall um, goalkeeper, sorry, so. You know, there's no reason why he's not going to play well. Right back, we've um, well, we've only got like four right backs in the club, so we want to go for Mankio, who is um a nice link player, and he's obviously in the Premier League still instead of his Sunderland card, which would be in the Championship. But obviously, FIFA has doesn't divert it at the end of the Ultimate Team and put the promoted teams in the champ in the Premier League and the relegated teams in the Championship. So he's still in the Championship, playing for Newcastle. 81 pace, 72 dribbling, 73 defending. And seventy four physical, just a pretty bog standard card, really. And left back, we gonna we want to go for a special card all the way down to the bottom of the club, and it is that untradeable Alex Tellez. Team of the season, eighty nine pace, seventy two shooting, ninety one passing, ninety six dribbling, eighty six defending, and eighty two physical, which is um which is pretty tasty. This squad's actually really like overpowered, considering the fact it's around a silver. You know, championship stri uh, striker. First time I've got for is Marcano, the team of the season. 75 pace, 70 dribbling, 93 defending, 72 passing, and 70, uh, 90 physical, sorry. Um, just looks monstrous. And you've got the reward, um, Nacho Fernandez from Real Madrid. 80 pace, 79 dribbling, 89 defending, 88 physical, and 80 passing. So a pretty brilliant looking defence and goalkeeper. You really can't complain about this team whatsoever. And the, the mid midfield just gets better. First player we want to go for is a, an untradeable um, special card, and I don't need to search because he is right there. It is the team of the season current in Taliso, obviously playing for Bayern Munich nowadays. 85 pace, 90 dribbling, 90 shooting, 88 defending, 91 passing, and 93 physical. That guy is just ridiculous. Middle centre mid is not a low to high. It is a high to low. It is a Paul Scholes in the middle um, getting a legend link to everyone, bringing everyone in the team together. Yes, he's five foot seven. Probably not the best central midfielder to go for in sense and sorry in terms of the formation right in the middle, but that's the way we've gone for it. Sixty nine pace, seventy eight dribbling, eighty five shooting, eighty nine passing, and seventy nine physical. And obviously the rocket of uh, of the right foot that that man does have. And the final midfielder is the second Huddersfield player and the second player that has made a massive impact um, in Huddersfield's campaign so far because they did win this weekend and I can't remember who they played uh, against but I know Aaron Moy got the only goal of that game uh, on Saturday I'm recording Sunday I'm just looking at the football now and they played against I've lost the game where is it no they played today tell a lie they played today they played Newcastle and beat them 1-0 and Aaron Moy was the only goal scorer what am I chatting about um, but you know this team of the season card just looks mad he had a team this season last year. Obviously, I, I titled it Aaron Moy, the new Man City boy. And he was a new Man City boy. And then he went on loan to Huddersfield and they bought him. And, you know, the good reason they bought him. He got into the team of the season for the championship. He's had a cracking start to the season so far uh, in the Premier League. And this card just looks ridiculous. 75 pace, 83 dribbling, 80 shooting, 74 defending, 87 passing, and 82 physical. And he cost me 80k. And that is his highest price cap. And... I bet he is, yeah, he's extinct. I got the last card on the market. So people want this card because of how well he's playing in real life. Um, we stick the team in a league going because it's the last two players. Um, first cam is Stefan Sessignon, a bit of a FIFA legend. 78 pace, 81 dribbling, 72 shooting, 74 passing, and 74 physical. Four star skill moves as well. So yeah, I really wanted him there for some of I'll tell you in a sec. Uh, a striker we go for, Laka Sweaty, the um, SPC card, just because... I've got him 88 pace, 88 dribbling, 88 shooting, 83 passing, and 84 physical. High high work rates, four star, four star, which is, you know, he's just a pretty sick card. 
Um, but obviously, end on the Mooney or Munier, whatever the hell his name is. 75 pace, 75 shooting, and 80 physical. Best FIFA stats he's got. He's obviously going to get a pretty decent upgrade next year. Six foot three. Three star skill moves. Uh, sorry, three star moves for two star skill moves. He only costs 8.7k. Obviously, he's going to be very, very cheap. The reason I went for Session Young is because they used to get a perfect match to each other, which is quite cool. Um, if you look at Mooney, I'm just going to call him, I'm just going to call him Steve, to be honest, because I'm just going to keep butchering his surname. Uh, he used to play for Montpellier and Huddersfield bought him in January, I believe. Got himself a 68 card, up, bumped up to 72, and he got a 74 um, upgrade to, well, I don't know, maybe. I don't, know. I, was saying this, I don't know really, but he's got himself a 74 in form and I want to get into some games and crack it out and see how well he does. So let's go get the first opponent. Right boys, the first opponent and not only have we gone brave because I'm still wearing the hand cast from injuring my wrist playing football, we've gone into foot champs and this is the first I've come up against. De Gea, end of an ear alarm, uh, Bailly, uh, footy this morning, in for Alonso, Premier SBC, David Luiz, Pogba, um, the SBC... Um, Vidal, he had a red 98 team of the season. Lewandowski, red 94 cam striker based down Kane. And I think he had uh, Sun up front. So this is going to be a very, very fun game to see how well we do. Because foot champs, I'm more or less one-handed. And uh, yeah, let's get into it. Let's see how we do. Oh, Munyet, well, Mooney, whatever his name is, Steve is through. Great save from Dahaya, and that little chip from Tellez doesn't work out. Mental. Oh, Lewandowski has done us, but great tracking back, I think, Marcano. Great bit of defending. I'm so glad I picked a good defence instead of doing something stupid and funky with the team. Oh, what a save from Diego Lopez. Pressure just wasn't enough by Manquillo. Palmed out for a corner. He's always doing something different here. Oh, Steve. Steve doing his defensive duties. Love it. Oh, he's gone one nil up. He's got such a vicious attack. That is just a ridiculous, ridiculous front three. All team as well. All the high rated special cards. Lewandowski's punished with a low driven into the bottom corner. 32 minutes played. We are 1 0 down, but it's still a long time to go. Oh, Sessignon with a beautiful turn. Oh, that first shot just isn't enough. We can't bundle the ball into the back of the net. What is going on there? Got ourselves a corner out of it. Steve is not taking this because he is the lanky we need him in the box. Oh, Moy. Moy's got a taste of it all. Some stattage on him. Whip this ball in. Deep. Lacazette. Taliso. Oh, he put it wide. I thought I was in the back of the net. Putting the pressure on. Oh, Steve with the lovely bit of dribbling. Oh, I thought he was coming over with Lam. That's just wrong move. Did the wrong move. Right, half time, one nil down. Um, it's a bit bittersweet, really, because we've played really well. You know, it's been pretty even. We've had four shots, two on target. He's had five and three. Even possession, smack bang, same passing. Just want to, you know, just want to come out with a win. Let's get into it. Let's get this win. The pace and the skill of Lacazette was too much. And who's there to finish? None other than Steve. Love it. Yes, boys. Great bit of uh, breakaway play by uh, Lacazette. Nice turn. Pass straight through. And the Hale should have probably saved that. But I'm not going to complain. We're back to 1-0. We've still got another half an hour left of the game. Assessing on with some beautiful dribbling. We've got Steve in on goal. Nice bit of dribbling. Blocked. Oh, corner goes wrong. And the shot from Moy is say Or hit the post, sorry. But Lacazette is on the spot to just get the rebound. And obviously, I'm recording this at 20 to 10 on a Sunday evening. And in the weekend league, at this point, if you're going to be losing, you're going to quit. And he's quit. Let's go get that second opponent, shall we? Right, by second opponent, and he has got another very sick side. He's got Footy's Butland, 
Um, he's got an anomaly, Danny Rose, Footy Smalling, Chiellini, Florenzi, CDM Totti in the bureau, which is quite interesting. He's got El Shari, SBC, uh, Premium, David Luiz, Player of the Month, Second Son, uh, Callahan, and Team of the Season, Drews Mertens. So, you know, like what happened in the last game, he had an insane team and we made him quit. Hopefully the exact same thing happens in this game. We've just got to play to find out, shall we? Let's go. Right, so we nearly conceded that, an own goal, and he's gone and brought on Obama Yang and taken off Callahan. Uh, I know, you know, Callahan's not the greatest player in the world, but he is just pure pace. So maybe he's changed formation. I will have a look at half time. Our oh, son is in acres of space, and what a save from Diego Lopez. Mate, he, he is really good. I did not expect him to be this good. And is that out for another corner? It is. Out for another one. He's going to play it short. And another corner. We're just on the defensive. Just That's what this game is so far. It's just being on the defensive. Oh, he's finally scored. Oh, my God. I've never seen it take someone so many times to score. He's had, like, 10 or 11 shots. And he just couldn't get the ball away. David Luiz just tackle, bounce straight to, to Aubameyang, who's just going to tuck that tidily into the back of the net. And it is the 88 SPC one. So, even pace here. one nil down. Not looking good so far. Oh, Steve has nearly scored. For someone that's got 69 dribbling, he's actually really, really good on the ball. I want to take this corner with Alex Tellez. Because he's the only left footer. And who's that? Straight out. I don't know who that was, but... Aaron Moy. Good save. Oh, Butland just doing his usual shit. Steve puts it through. Sessin Young. Oh, he's diving header. Is just saved by Butler and he literally got a fingertip on the ball and it stops it from going in. We want to I'm going to ping this corner in with Aaron Moy again blocked out. He's there. Skulls. Oh, he's hit the post. Oh my god. He's had his attack and now it's our turn. Oh, he's got such a dangerous team on the attack. Such a dangerous team on the attack. He had Mertens up there with Sun, and he just Sun just does his shit and dribbles away from you. And Totti's not ever going to miss that. And we're 2 0 down. Oh, Sessin Young is through. Oh, his shot is just so bad. He's so good at getting into positions, and then he's just dreadful at finishing. Oh, and Sun is away. He's going to make it three, isn't he? Oh, Diego Lopez, you beast. What, what a block. Steve using his strength, and Butland is just too good on this game. He stops us. Right, half time, 2 0 down. Um, clearly, he's been the better player. 8 shot, 7 on target, 6 and 5 for us, 57% position in his favour. Passing's pretty pretty even. I want to have a look at what what he's doing with his team. What formation? He's gone to the same as ours. He's playing Tossi, David Luiz, and El Shawi in midfield. I really don't understand it to be honest. Like such such a like such an attacking team, and I'm really not happy with how uninvolved Aaron Moy's been. So what is he five for six? Mm, bloody hell! Uh, we've got a very short midfield. I'm very I'm unhappy with how little Aaron Moy's been involved. So we're going to chuck him at camp. Put Sessing your back in midfield because. Sessing Young can't finish his dinner. Um, hopefully, get a goal with each of the Hollyfield boys, but we'll have to play the second half and see how it goes. Oh, Steve with a lovely bit of dribbling, and Butland is doing my fucking head in. He's, he's good, but he's never normally that good. Very bouncy football, and Aaron Moy has hit us back into contention to get into the like into this game. A great 
bit of awareness from Mooney, Steve, to get the ball. It bounces up. Nice one two to Aaron Moy, who hits that ball very, very hard. Off the post it in. Oh, my, uh, any other keeper and son in that position, I'm shitting myself. But I'm really good with having Diego Lopez in net against him because he's stopped loads of shots he's had against us. Corner is semi-cleared. Oh, Aaron Moy, lovely hold play, puts Lacazette through and Lacazette storms us back into the game. Great counter-attack. Great team, and uh, Aaron Moy is fantastic. A lovely dink throw. I thought it was offside, like the rest of the players putting their hands up, and Lacazette just buries that in the top corner. We're back into this game. Steve, he's put us in the lead. What has happened? We've gone from 2 0 down to winning this game 3 2. Both Huddersfield boys involved in the goals. Oh my god. Putting. Aaron Moy at Cam has been the best decision I have made in this video. A beautiful finish from Steven to the bottom corner. And we're now 3 2 up. Oh, lovely pass in. Steve gets over to Lacazette. He misses the ball. What is he doing? He's gone straight through his legs. Oh, Aaron Moy is not finished. He wants a second. He's. Oh, Smalling, as always, stops me. And that is the end of the game. Somehow, we went from 2 0 down to win 3 2. Somehow, I think the downfall in this guy's team was that midfield. How attacking that midfield is with El Shawi Totti. Totti's normally a striker, a centre forward. El Shawi's a winger slash midfielder. And David Luiz is just notorious for being attacking. So I think that was his downfall. Steve gets man of the match with himself. One goal, one assist. Moy um, and Lacazette chipping with the goals. And Moy and the skulls chipping with the assist. But, boys, that's been the video. I'm going to cut it there. I'm going to cut it there. Um, what a team. Huddersfield, good luck to you in the Premier League. You've got some fantastic players. This has been the new Huddersfield Boys video. I hope you have all enjoyed, guys. As always, links down to Twitter and Instagram in the description below. Go down there, drop me a follow, drop a like on the video, and drop a sub if you're new around here. Same as some guys. Have an awesome day, and I shall see you all later. Bye.